I woke up late around 5 p.m. today and decided I needed a break. A break from being the heel. A break from being dead. Over the past seven months, I've written and narrated over 60 stories, many of them short and styled after the early days of creepypasta. It seems the nature of these stories, indeed, maybe just my presence, my coming into existence, has confused many people. I have taken the narrating stories that I didn't write, although that isn't my end goal here. From the beginning, I put some strict rules about this channel of myself. Things hidden. Things that maybe I'll explain one day, but to put it simply, this video wasn't part of it, nor were my auxiliary narrations. In between writing, narrating, doing acetone transfers, continuing my visual art practice, sowing doubt in the minds of children, and drinking a plastic rock glass of four and a half ounces of acetone every morning, I've realized I need a temporary change. I won't be gone long, nor have my overall plans changed. The goal was as it is. It always has been doubt. Consider this but a momentary face turn for plot convenience. I simply have some big plans and empty acetone jugs. In the meantime, there will be light content, but I'll explain when we get there. The problem is that being the bad guy means that you can't thank those that support you. But I've never been one to absolutely adhere to anything. Obviously, I'm making this video. So I've thanked people before and I'll do it again. Thanks to everyone that supports me. Thanks to everyone that leaves comments. Thanks to everyone that shares my work. Thanks to my colleagues, David King of Ben Night Marinera, King Spook, Cool Matter, and Workday Ross. Thanks to my most earnest of fans, Internet Ghost, Alice Jones, Blair Kent, Alex King, and Mary Annie Adams. Thanks to all of those nameless people in my life. And certainly, thanks to all those that doubt me. Doubt is really my goal here.